Hey Blade Ops, today we are doing a desktop demo of a CRKT. It is the Ritter RSKMK5 product code 2380. This is the kind of the stainless steel stone wash finish. They also make a black model. Um, so it comes, first of all, it comes with this tin, and inside the tin is the knife, which I'll show you in a second. And it also comes with this little paper. And on the paper, it says building your pocket survival tin around the RSK MK5, Doug Ritter. Thank you for buying it, blah, blah, blah. Then it talks about a few of the things that you could try and add to your tin if you can fit them, blah, blah, blah. So fire starter, tinder, signal mirror, whistle, compass, um, duct tape, which I think is always a must, needle and thread, safety pins, aluminum foil, nylon cord, pencil and paper, wire, water pur purification, flashlight, fishing kit, basic medical supplies like band-aids and such, and any personal medications. I'd really like to see how much of all that you could fit in it and how you'd fit in it. Maybe I'll take one of these and see what I can do for a survival kit. But there's lots of videos out there. I'd love to see what someone's done. Uh, feel free to make a video response to this video if you've done it. So that's a little paper that comes with it. There's the tin and I'll show you how the knife fits in there. It does come with a little piece of lanyard, so the knife fits in there diagonally. Um, there's plenty of space. If you move the cord to the side, I mean, that's all the way down to the bottom. There's plenty of room for some other stuff. So, comes with the uh, plastic injected molded sheath. Got the Doug Ritter logo on there in the CRKT. It's got a little lanyard up top, so you could probably wear it as a neck knife if you want. Fits in there nice. Doesn't shake. It's got some nice retention, and there's the knife. Simple uh, handle cutout design, no handle, some holes up there. Got some ridges up top, so when you grip it like this, you can do some cutting. And it also has, um, I like it when they put the grooves down there by your index finger very useful. Looking at a full flat grind, basically stone wash finish and overall 3.8 inches and under an ounce, under an ounce which is nice. Um, the blade is sub 2, two inches, so 1.75 inch. And the price on this with the shipping and everything included is $23.99. Pretty good price. The highlights for me is the size. It's super small. Whether you carry it in the tin or if you just carry it um, like so, that's very small. You could throw that in your pocket. I mean, you could almost, you could probably fit that in your wallet. So it's small, it's inexpensive, it comes with a tin, those are the highlights. As far as drawbacks, I, I can't really find one. Um, if you're gonna get really picky on uh, the handle, but you could also, you could always tie a fob or some sort of lanyard right there to extend your grip, so. Let me know what you think. Um, about the RSK MK5, the Ritter knife, um, and the tin. Comment down below. Let me know what you'd add to your tin, and be sure to let me know what you think about the knife. Check it out, Blade Ops.